I know this doesn't look the best, but I'm going to explain what it is and how you get it. Um, this is pomegranate peel tea, and how you make it is basically you take pomegranate peels and you dehydrate them. And how you do that is you cut the pomegranate, peel it as you normally would. I've got videos about how to quickly do that. You can freeze the pomegranate seed. Um, I have a video about that. And then you dehydrate the peels. And I just dehydrate them in quarters like this. You can break them up a little smaller if you want. I would probably cut up, this is a really thick piece of um, inner peel. So I'm going to break that up a little bit. Then you stick it on a dehydrator at about 130 temperature for uh, 24 hours or so. Um, mine I had on a little bit longer than that. I wanted it super dry because I'm just going to store it and I didn't want it to mildew. Um, I forgot to share, cut off anything that's it's yicky or moldy or dented. That one got dinged in transit or something. So I just cut that area off. Then dehydrate it for the 24 hours. Make sure you got if it's pliable at all, you don't want to put it in um, because you want it completely dry. Then um, you can put it and grind it up in a Vitamix. I have a Vitamix and I did use that, but it still left it a little bit chunky. So I used the a little coffee grinder that I have to grind it up even a little bit more into a really fine powder. But there are still some chunks in there, and so if I just did this with a Vitamix, but now you can see there's a little bit of chunks in there. And since I've been taking it, um, I can handle the chunks that are like this, but there are some bigger chunks. So when I get down to the bottom where it's a little bit thicker, um, proc the, any kind of coffee grinder should take care of it that does gri ground beans or uh, any kind of coffee, anything that's dry. You need a, a something that does dry. So if you have a blender that does not do dry, such as a Vitamix, then you want to find you want to use a coffee grinder or something else. But so I Vitamixed it, then I ground it, uh and then I you can put it in a tea uh strainer, but I don't mind the chunks and personally it's just more benefit for that. Check out my blog, thesecretisgratitude.com, for the benefits of of this and you can type in pomegranate tea at the bottom of the home page. Um, I also, uh, you can buy pomegranate juice, but you don't get the benefits of the peel. The peel has some um, really wonderful benefits, which I will post on my blog. But um, one of those is UV protection. It's the only fruit I know that will actually protect your skin against the sun damage. So that's just one thing. But anyway, um, check out my blog, thesecretisgratitude.com, and check out my YouTube channel. There's over 500 videos on there. And the secret is gratitude. And thanks for watching and have a blessed day.